Hi, I'm Sophia. I am 18 years old. This was my first COVID Classy camp. My name is Donna. I'm 17. I did COVID Classy this um, summer 2020 for the first time. I'm Nyla. I'm 16 and I've done COVID Classy in 2019 and 2020. Our app was called Empower You and we wanted to highlight the importance of many movements that are going on in today's society. So we wanted to highlight the Black Lives Matter movement, the coronavirus pandemic, 2020 census and the importance of voting. And we wanted to create this app that provided um, factual information that would notify our users um, the importance of these movements and how they can get involved. I can't speak for Sophia and Donna, but I feel like as a three of us are women of color, all of the issues hit us home really deeply. I'm really glad I did join this app so that I can talk about what I feel in these issues and how it affects me and other people like Donna and Sophia. I feel like we started off by thinking as like young adults what we would want to see. So we started off by not only petitions and donations, but most importantly, education. When we did our research, we also would like keep it sort of condensed so it's like easy to read because young adults and teenagers may have like short attention spans, but this way like they could really get like the bulk and the important information in a condensed version. And then also making sure we could like provide links that they could go and even uh, get to know more about the topic. And I think since we're all in quarantine because of the coronavirus and everything, I think we attach those movies and TV shows to just like, you're not doing anything else. You might as well inform yourself. I feel like we all started off believing that we could never make our own app. It's just so weird, like an app. I want to say how definitely the environment of COVID Classy helped so much in the end product. Like, the instructors and the IAs were incredibly helpful. We would send them a Slack and next thing you know, they would show up and help us all the way. Like, and they wouldn't leave until we figured it out. I came into camp, this was my first time and I was like excited, but I was also nervous. But like from the get go, I was just so like welcomed and I really enjoyed how welcoming everyone was and instructors and instructor assistants, they were always ready to help us. Like Donna said, but just like on Slack, if you ever had a question, like you would immediately get responses from like five or six camp members as well as our instructors and instructor assistants so like just the support was so amazing I've already had like camp members reach out to me and be like we should definitely stay in touch and so like I just really loved that feeling of like feeling welcomed and also just empowered as a woman in STEM like going into college now like just feeling so comfortable with coding and more confident in myself and my abilities and like as our group like we just continue to build our confidence by learning these new things we should like definitely continue to improve our app so that we could hopefully one day make it on the app store because it's such a great app that would be really beneficial to a lot of people to learn about these movements. Uh, just learning that we could do so much with code is awesome. In two days it's remarkable what we've done. There's definitely room for improvement and I'd love to see that indigo color that took us so long on the app store that the icing on top of the cake for us. I really just want to make this app as much as it can be and have other people use it so that they can inform themselves and we can try making a better society. All we can do is try at first.